If you are signed in into your Google account in Google Chrome, then you can work around with these sync settings to choose what to sync and what not to sync. So in order to work around with that option, you go on to the top right and click on this three button right here. And then what you can do is you can click on settings. So once you do that, you can see that you have your settings right here. And here, the second option, as you can see, is sync and Google services right here. Once you click on it, you can see that you get option on to manage what you sync. If you were to click on this, you can see that you can go around. So right now, uh, the option is sync everything, but you can go ahead and customize things right here. So you can choose whether you want to sync up apps or not right here. So if you have installed apps, then you can see that you can go around and sync that up or disable that. You can sync up bookmarks or you can sync up extensions, history, settings, themes, open tabs, passwords, address, phone number, and even payment method. So let's say you want to be on the secure side, you want to disable the password sharing address and payment method. So now what happens is that only these things that you have selected will be synced across devices. But yeah, even if you were to enter a password in one device, it won't be synced up onto the other device. In my case, I'm just going to enable all of them. But depending on what you want and what you don't want, you can sync everything or customize the sync. And that is how you can use the advanced customized sync settings inside of Google Chrome to sync out what you want through settings in Google Chrome. So hope you guys learn something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe.